guys, this is Remy here. Welcome back to Amnesia Later and Crowd. Later Crowd. I don't know if it's Amnesia Memories Later Crowd or not, but we're here back at home. Or not even home yet. We haven't left. So we're supposed to wear a yukata tomorrow. Do you even own a yukata? It's fine if you don't have one, but in that case, what should we do? Then we still haven't figured out who you promised to the fireflies, what? Seems like everyone is coming tomorrow, so hopefully whoever it was will approach you about it. Oh, Toma, what do you want? Hey! Oh, it's... Are you by yourself? Shin here. I don't feel comfortable being just alone with you. Perfect timing without you get off work soon. Oh my God. <laughs> Did you memorize her schedule, Toma? That's kind of creepy. How rude. But for your information, hers isn't the only schedule I memorize. I know yours too. That's even more creepy. You always try to sneak in shifts the day before your test. You did that just the other day too. When the manager noticed, he threatened to commit seppuku as a donut for stunting your academic growth. Talking him down is a major pain, so I promise to keep an eye on your schedule from now on. And decide to watch out for Michiko too. Okay, sure. So it's all your fault. I was wondering why the manager is being so picky with my schedule. Well, in that case, hurry up and get accepted into university. Then you can work at the cafe as often as you want. <laughs> I don't want to waste time here. Let's go, Michiko. Hey, wait a minute. Where are they taking us? Shin, don't be so pushy. Look how confused she looks. <laughs> she always looks that way. Shin, just hold on. The manager messaged us, uh, us earlier. I guess we're going firefly hunting tomorrow. Neither Shin or I have a yukata. We talked about going to Bago, going to go by one. Then Shin said you don't have one either, and he suggested we invite you to come with us. Shut up. So we decided to drop by around the time your shift ends. Let's go check the nearby mall and see if they sell yukata. We don't have time or money to make our own, so let's just buy a ready made one. Makes sense. Oh, I see. Gosh, I was so surprised to see them when we turned around. But that's perfect. Let's go, Michiko. If it were just the two of us, we wouldn't know what to buy. But if they're with us, we'll be fine. Will we? I think we'll be fine even without them. Oh, it's pink. I love pink. Wait, what? Well, ah, oh, of course Toma picks the one I want. No, Shin, I have to disagree with you this time. I kind of like the one he has. It's very, very cute. 
I told you already. Pastel colors are so out of style. Pastel you say pastel, but this has a blossom pattern on top of a white base. I quite like it. Childish? <laughs> you always pick such childish clothes. I'm telling you, dark blue is much better. Childish? <laughs> Don't look at my room, I guess. That's <laughs> The colors are nice, but that pattern is so tacky. And look, the pattern doesn't match. Did you even check? Then what about this blue? It's fine, but when you say it, it's a bit basic. Then we'll get a flashier obi to balance it out. Flashy Obi, so what color would you suggest? <laughs> Yellow. I'm assuming the, the Obi is a, the wrap around part around the waist to make a bow. I don't know, Shin. I'm kind, I'm kind of leaning towards the pink in Toma's hands as much as I don't want to agree with Toma. <laughs> Yellow, huh? <laughs> Why do you look so upset? <laughs> I'm wearing yellow. Wouldn't it look weird when we walk together? Such a selfish reason. Shan, you should change it. The, I don't know if it's Geta or Gita. You chose for yourself. I think you'll hurt your feet. You can get away with a small size smaller. Mind your own business. About them helping us, I may have spoken too soon. They're totally ignoring you and arguing amongst themselves. I sure hope tomorrow will be okay. This is a shin. I think it's just like random panels, it's not like main panels. Bro, finally home. <laughs> three hours? I'm so tired. It took us three hours to pick. And it was already sunset by that time. So what time are we home? Like 9 p.m. or something? You should never go out with those two again. It was fun at first, but they're just too much. <sighs> Well, I guess it was kind of fun. Toma's pretty knowledgeable and Shin's curt, but nice. Iki, Ken, and Shin. Toma and Yukio. Oh, and the manager and the girls at the cafe. They're all so kind to you. I really like everyone. But I wonder who you made plans to see the fireflies with. I guess that's the point where we get to choose whoever we want to go with. So this will obscure. August 12th. It's been 11 days since we lost our memories. So, guess this is everyone. Oh, I love her hair piece. I want it. Oh, look at you. So cute. You look so good in Yukata. My rivalry spirit is igniting. Mina is so cute still. I pick her over Rika. Jealousy makes a woman despicable, Mine. It's silly to be complaining over individual beauty. She right. She's right. A rose has its own beauty, as does a lily. They both look really nice in their yukata, but I think they might have overdone it. What do you mean? I think it's fine. It's not every chance to get to dress up, so why not go all out? 
理科に関しては普段着より浴衣の方が地味に見えるんだな。But that said, I feel like a yukata suits Rika even more than modern clothes do. で、これを見た後で、And after seeing them, <laughs> so、you know, you stand up. Sawa looks so casual. <laughs> now, now I can tell why Orion was like, they kind of went overboard. Because Sawa over here with a very like, simplified classic look. Oh, look at you. I like your choice. You look good. Sawa will be the only one who will be able to get the same thing. Why is it that when I see Sawa, I just suddenly feel a brush of comfort? So, yeah, what is it that I'm going to do? Uh, I hate to say it, but Tomo looks good too. He's very casual wear. Of course she does, shit, and I picked it out for her. What did they end up picking? Is it maybe like a purple? Like a light purple? We looked at so many, we just couldn't seem to agree. We even got an argument towards the end. Because I feel like purple is like the medium of the, the blue and pink. Damn Shin! Shin looks so good. I like his outfit more than Tomo's. <laughs> That's because we were meddling into what I chose. Why are you always trying to boss people around? I'm not trying to boss you around, but you're trying to wear a. that word that wasn't the right size. I told you that you'd hurt yourself. Why wouldn't you listen to me? I did. I tried it on again and made the same choice. Shin suddenly looks so mature in this yukata. Black yukatas are pretty cool, huh? Yeah, it does. Toma looks like he's an owner of a shop or something. <laughs> he looks good too. Well, if you put him beside Shin, I would run away with Shin so fast. Toma looks like a golden retriever boy right now. And someone who surprisingly looks good. Is it Kent? Oh, he looks so calm. And his, uh, his colors. That looks so good on him. Uchiko, your yukata. Toma and Shin chose it. Oh, I missed out. Yukata motte haite shittega. Boku ga yorokonde eranda no ni. Shippai shita. If I had known you didn't own one, I would have happily chosen one for you. Sono kurai no koto de sono ochikomi yo ka. Kudara na, ikki. Yukata erabi nado taishita imi wa nai. Ah, I feel like I'm like leaning towards Kent more than everyone else, strangely enough. So I wonder if he was the one that ranked high on my list. I kind of, I kind of want to want to lean towards Kent in the first playthrough of this game. <laughs> Are you seriously that upset about something so small? How foolish of you, Ikio. <laughs> I'm surprised by these two. Iki totally rocks his yukata, and Kent looks like a writer. Well, as for Kent, where did he even find that belt? Come on now. You're telling me you wouldn't be a little excited if she wore the yukata you chose for her. Well, that's what I thought. <laughs> <gasps> no, not really. I'm not interested in that kind of stuff anyway. Your expression and voice say otherwise, Ken. What a missed opportunity. Toma and Shin really got me there. Well, it's not your fault you didn't know, Iki. Those two are my childhood friends, so they would know. Huh? <laughs> Wait, why is Rika so upset? I thought Rika was into Iki, not Toma and Shin. What? Toma and Shin chose Michiko's Yukata? Really? Oh, no. <laughs> I wish I had the opportunity to choose for her. Actually, I wouldn't mind Rika picking uh, mine out, unless she's gonna sabotage me and pick something super hella ugly. 
浴衣を売っている店という店を回り全力を持ってこの子に一番似合う浴衣を探し出しましたのに Well actually no never mind take my words back I will go with her <laughs> I would have gone to every store and would have chosen the absolute best one for her Such a pity Everyone sure seems like That's a good thing but Mr. Ko, does not everyone's affection feel a bit overwhelming? Am I the only one here who understands boundaries? Probably. What if I wanted to pick my own, huh? <laughs> not only did Sawa speak up for you, it seems like she has your back. What a relief. Everyone else either has personal space problems or is too distant. Speaking of the person who, that's too distant, where is that guy? He's supposed to be our guide. He must be around here somewhere. Yukio, why are you hiding watching us from all the way over there? Oh, he's over there? Aw, he looks so adorable with his hair back. I I'm not watching you, I'm watching over you. <laughs> There's Yukio, he looks normal. Maybe it's because he tied his hair? Either way, he doesn't seem as suspicious. From my point of view, it's best to watch over from the shadows, living in the dark, dawn to dawn. Oh my god, he has a sword. Waka has a sword, and his emblem of his store. <laughs> you mean like 24 hours a day? Man, Waka looks different with all his glasses. Besides, you are our guide for today. If you hide, it's kind of defeats the purpose. He's right. We need Yukio to guide us, but more than that. What's got me really bothered is. Is it not? That is not a yukata. Is it like a a outfit for duel or something? <laughs> I want to say it. I want to say it too. Why can't he hear me? Like, what is the term kendo? Is it kendo? I might be wrong. There's still something about it that suits him. I'm still not letting it go though. Oh, seems like we're all here. Let's go. Don't get too close. Don't go too far. Stay out of my range of attacks. Your attacks. No one's gonna comment on that. Okay. An hour later. Oh, this is odd. There aren't any fireflies. We're pretty far into the woods, though. Maybe they ran away because there are so many of us. No way, fireflies don't behave like that. Otherwise, people wouldn't go out firefly hunting in the first place. Then that means. Yukio has the wrong place. Doesn't he have bad memory or like bad directional sense? <laughs> yeah. Yukio's always been bad with directions. But I remember the area where I took the photo. 
この辺りは広い川で場所の特定は難しいかもしれません I guess it's hard to find the exact location. それに昨日からの冷え込みに耐えられなかった可能性もある。一概に有教殿の席ではなかろう。It did get very cold last night, so that could be why they're gone. It might not be Yu-Gi-Oh's fire. Oh, I'm so sorry. Aww. Yeah, I am a little bit of a night. I'm 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 a little bit of a night. No need to apologize. I, for one, enjoyed the walk. I'm a little bit of a night. 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 Exactly. Plus, we were able to see the girls dressed up in Yukata. Seems like a win to me. Is that all that goes through your head, Iki? Jin, how rude. I'm so sorry, Iki. He can be a bit blunt. What? <laughs> It's the truth, isn't it? Are you saying that there is something wrong with that? Alright, everyone, from here on out, why don't we have some free time? It's a nice night. Feel free to hang out and talk, or split up and look for fireflies. You could also go down and walk around the river as well. However, it's nighttime. We should make sure the girls are accompanied, understand? You hear that? What do you want to do? Who do you want to go with? <laughs> Uh, is this a major choice here? I don't know when the major choices are happening. Iki or Kent, Shin or Toma, Yuki or Manager, one of the girls. Um, mentally, I already had my sights on Kent, so. Kent. Mentally, we're gonna try to go for Kent first. Where's Kent? Oh, there he is. He's with Iki over there. Is something the matter? Do you need me for something? Yes, I need your attention, please. <laughs> Ken is clearly uh, not a man that knows much about talking to girls. <laughs> You'd have to say it that way, Ken. She approached you during her free time. That means she wants to talk to you. Is that so? How strange. <laughs> well, either way, you've come at an opportune time. We were just about to approach you with an idea. But we didn't know how to approach you. I mean, I've never approached a woman for a midnight drive before. A midnight drive? Ken, you've got to explain better. Chica, why don't we ditch this place and head for a drive? Just the three of us. I don't think there are many fireflies here, but we heard we might be able to find some in Shinano. That was on the news, right? That's super far away. Based on the news reports and Firefly e Ecology, there's a high probability we'll find some there. If we head out now, we should be able to get there in two and a half hours. Well, 
むしろたやすいことだよね。As a result, to get to Shinano alone is a dual blow. Rather easily, easy actually. 片道2時間半だ。行ってしまえば今日中には戻れないと思う。However, seeing as it takes just over two hours to get there, we probably won't be able to come back tonight. As you are a lady, I'm unsure how appropriate it would be to have you accompany us overnight. She lives alone. We don't have work tomorrow. College is on summer break. It's no big deal. I like how Iki is automatically making reasons why I should be able to go still. College students pull all nighters all the time. Alright, these two are older than I am. Because Iki's in his fourth year. Which would make him what? 18, 20, 20, 22. Kent is a grad student, whatever that fucking means. I'm assuming he already graduated. So he may be 23. I'm assuming he's only a year older than Inky. However, she's only 19. Considering that, maybe it's not okay for her to be out so late. So you know, say she's not going to be a good one. But if she has a chaperone, it should be fine. But if she has a chaperone, it should be fine. But if she has a chaperone, it should be fine. You and I are both old enough to be her chaperone. So, I see. Hold on. That doesn't seem right. I thought only family could be a chaperone. Listen, we're all adults now, technically. We don't need any chaperone. <laughs> And I feel as if two men carting a single woman around is more of a problem. Kent, I thought you were going to ask me on a midnight drive, but now I feel like you're backpedaling on the idea that you came up with. Ah, it's Oh, he suggested it. Good grief, you're so noisy. Ken, when I suggested this, you seemed happy. <laughs> I was just interested in the act of observing the ecosystem of the firefly. She is unrelated. So he doesn't care if we're there or not. Got it. Feelings hurt. Got it. <laughs> Sekuro Shinano is the purpose. The driving between has no meaning to me, understood? I won't make claims that driving in and of itself can't be fun, but that's when it's just us. To take a woman out in the middle of the night in a car seems inappropriate. What's with you all of a sudden? She'll be fine. There are three of us, right? Iki, I don't. I, I do not like the way you word in your sentence. If I were to do anything to her, you'd stop me, wouldn't you, Ken? Of course. If you try to make a move, I think I'd at least try to stop you. I'd never do something so crass, but why did you say I think? It'd be preferred if you gave it your all. But if she wanted you to, why would I stop it? Well, I wouldn't. Hey, this is a. That, that's an AB conversation. I don't need to be present for this. How do you know? A handsome young man like yourself? A blushing young lass? <laughs> Caught up in the light of the fireflies? There is no way something like that would happen tonight between her and me. There, see? We have nothing to worry about. You won't make a move, and you'll stop me if I do. 
何の問題もない。Nothing wrong with that. <笑> Deceptive, however. まあいい。ここは君の意思に任せよう。Whatever. We'll leave it to you, Michiko. 私と一気。三人でのドライブ。目的はシナノでホタルガリ。帰宅はおそらくアスミナ。A drive with the three of us to search for fireflies in Shinano. Sh- Shinano? Returning back here tomorrow. There will be two of us. We vow to respect your boundaries, but it's up to you to trust us. What do you say? So, what do you say? Um, I think you should go. What do you think? I mean, they're so stuck on this firefly thing. There has to be a reason behind it. If it was with one of them alone, I'd be afraid we'd slip up, but with the two of them. If it's these two, even if you stay quiet, they'll keep the conversation going.、Mm. That's facts. <laughs> yeah, in order for you to regain your memories, let's go, Michiko. <laughs> let's figure out why they want to show, you fire- show fireflies to you so much. Bring it on. <laughs> like I'm saying it like it's a challenge. Alright, l we'll, we'll, we'll go along with them. It wouldn't hurt. Which is funny because in the very beginning, I was supposed to just go with Toma, Sawa, and Nine, and then、uh, Iki invited us, and I was scared we we're gonna have to decide between the two, which we kind of end up doing anyway, deciding to go with Iki and Ken. Please take me with you.、Mm. I said, please. That's it. <laughs> Maybe the bring it on was for Iki. And the please is for Kent. The lady has spoken, so shall we? What are you freezing up for, Ken? What has gone into you, please? I never thought you'd speak like that outside of work. Are you trying to get at me emotionally so I'll make a mistake? <laughs> Are you trying to manipulate me to fall in love with you? <laughs> maybe, maybe. Do you have a problem with that, sir? Because you hurt my feelings by saying you don't care if I was even there. You just care about the fireflies, which is fair enough. That's the whole point why everyone's here for the fireflies. <laughs> A good strategy, but don't think I'll fall for that so easily. You have to do better than that. What's gone into you, Ken? That's too much suspicion, even from you. Aren't you reading too much into it? Iku, you just don't understand how we normally interact. How do we normally interact? <laughs> just jab at each other? That's why, we, that's why you can only offer a commonplace opinion. What? Are you guys like fighting buddies? Oh my god, are we enemies to lovers? Okay, rivals to lovers. <laughs> I'd say we're more like debate buddies. We always act professionally together at work, but that's not how we usually are. Well, whatever. I don't really get it, but we're going, right? Let's grab a room in Shinano. It'll be tough to go and then drive back. Okay, 
Mm, we don't have to spend the night. We need a base. It's not good to have you in a car all night. So, I don't know. That makes sense. Then I'll leave the book in the UEQ. Got it. I'll do it while you grab the car. I can look for a lodge on my phone. Are you sure you can even find one for two night? Especially if everyone might be doing the same thing. Let's hurry. If we go now, we can get there before 10. Oh, so it's not really a midnight drive. Per se. If they're like leaving at 8. Right now, to get there by 10. Wait, wrong. 7.30. I got ready at Ken's It wasn't con- I wasn't- I wasn't confident wearing this thing on my own. Oh, so Ken helped you into it. But this is where we're gonna stop for today's episode. We are going to journey in adventure to firefly hunting with Kent and Iki. Because I am gonna try my damnedest to get Ken's route if this that's even a possible thing. I don't know. There's possible marriage at one of these endings. <laughs> which I believe is gonna be with Shin, clearly, because I believe he's the main guy um, that the creators have favored the most but thank you guys for watching today's episode stay beautiful and i'll see you guys in the next one